16th year in the parade. The driver is Garth Luke. They want to thank the parade committee and everyone in the crowd for making this a special event. Patriot Farms asks that you remember our troops wherever they are stationed. And special thank you to our veterans, police officers, firefighters, and EMTs, and their families that are in the crowd. Merry Christmas from the Patriot Farms Inch. I like the whole theme, how the horses were dressed like the wagon, right? That's right, absolutely. I know. This is Heather Kaufman of Kaufman Stables. The horse is Tika. She's an eight-year-old. She is pulling a Surrey carriage that has been restored. Santa! Santa and Mrs. Claus are on the wagon as well. Tika has recently won numerous grand and reserve championships and national horse shows this past October. The Kaufman Stables and Tika would like to wish everyone a safe and happy holiday season. Everyone, here comes Jim Kilburn from Kilburn Family Farm. The sponsor is the City of Lebanon. Corey and Kevin are 14-year-old Percheron horses that are farm grown. The Kilburn family would like to wish everyone a very, very Christmas. And Merry Christmas to you, Kilburn family. Thanks for coming in. As I mentioned, folks, many, many of our communities Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Facebook and Instagram and reach out to reserve and book your event with Once Upon a Dream Force and Carriage. Beautiful. Here 
because Matt Gary, Matt Gary's farm. Next, Gary is a rooster, three string turn under pass. Matt has been part of the parade either as a driver or a snout walker for 29 of the 33 parades. Thank you so much, Matt. That carriage was built in 1800. I don't keep a Ford for eight years. You know, 1800, my goodness, 200. Appaloosa Gildy. He's pulling a restored 1895 carriage. This is Henry's 14th Lebanon Parade, and he and his driver wish everyone a Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. There. Coming up next is Angela Bull from Sterling Silver Mini Farm, sponsored by Evans Wild Acres. Sterling Silver Mini Farm is owned and operated by Sterling, and Angela Bull is located in Miamisburg, Ohio. This is their first parade. Welcome. Uh, and their horse is pulling. Uh, their buddy is Dylan. Dylan is Tetris. You can be found on Facebook under Sterling Silver Mini Farm. Sterling and Angela want to wish everyone a blessed Christmas season. All right, I think she's got the silver mini cream over there. Let us know there is a treat waiting for them when they get back. If you want a treat, go check out all the vendors down here at this road. This is what you can get a treat. And this is his second parade. Uh, his first being King's High School Homecoming Parade this fall. He's only been pulling a cart. He's a newbie. He's only been pulling a cart since late this summer. He's very sweet and lives loves all living things. His favorite treats are apples. We were just talking about that. But they have to be sliced as he likes to take little bites. Here comes Renee Miller of Pine Valley Farm. Renee and her mini Lulu from Batavia Pine Valley Farm. Happy holidays is what they want to wish you. Don't 
Family carriage from nearby nearby Oregonia, owned by Molly, a gentle Welsh pony, for the tenth consecutive year in this parade. Joined by the children Jules, Clara, and Caleb, and parents Norbert and Marie Rose. Marie Rose, there's I'm struggling with a small friend. Why the party music? Those are Sophie and Andy from Left Students. Participating in the second year of the Lebanon Horse Parade, she has been showing feather in the fourth, excuse me, in the 4-H for the past two years in Hunter and Jumper. All right, coming up next is old uh, Fettuccine Tina. Miranda's Ice Cream Shop of Moro is the bar name. Next up is the unicorn of Miranda's a Great Pony. Mascot of Miranda's Ice Cream Shop of Moro pulling a wooden Amish cruiser cart. Please visit the unicorn and reopen in March 2023. Okay, hey, that's coming up. Up next we have Tim Hall of Wheatstone Farm. I have been pulled by two half halfway draft horses, May and Sugar. By Tim and Tess Hall of Hollingsburg, Ohio. Our blockers are Jeff Hall. We're going to be stocking this is a large area. It's a 122 acre nonprofit working farm in Edendale, Ohio, with a mission to educate. The GHF Farms Club volunteers work with our mules to learn how to harness and drive equines. Forming heritage farm entries. Are there beloved the mules, Tom and Hunt's Walden of Georgetown, Ohio, to provide entertainment to DDS centers throughout southwestern Ohio for their summer programs as well as events on the park? That was like a party bus of characters in the back. It was, it was. The Hunt's Walden and mules were you and your family a wonderful party season. Lebanon's own Main Street Carriage. Known as a Morgan Persheron Persheron of 1800 years. Going over the world's first That's Tom and John! Beautiful, beautiful carriage. Yeah. Oh, just as well as the Phoenix from Finn Street Farm. Sponsored by Sharecrafts and Lebanon Ford. Ryan Wolf Fink is a Finch Creek Farm, Xenia, Ohio, driving a Cooper Waller wagon, pulled by Percheron Gelders. Those are Andy and Charlie. The Finkers have also played the big carriage ride downtown today during our uh, afternoon festivities. Driving a people hauler wagon pulled by a person. Hi, Warmeyers. <laughs> Andy and Charlie are the horses' names. The Finks also do carriage rides downtown during the afternoon festivities. What is that yellow bell? Is that from? Is that from? Merry Christmas!
the Grinch? Hide the Christmas decorations. The Grinch is coming. Hide the presents, everybody. The Grinch is being <laughs> is leading the pack here. This is Peter Mangle, Salt Run Staples, and who's in second year's veterans, ACM Dude. Salt Run Staples for the first time. With a Santa on his back. Stupid. Sir Winston's going to take care of the Grinch for everybody. Don't worry about him. Yeah. Is everyone having a nice time? All right, we're so glad you're here. We were blessed with really nice weather tonight. Feels like Christmas. All right, we love you, Grinch. We love the blind sales more. are ready to go. This is Alan Stanley, Mary Ann Hill Farm. Beautiful Bergerons. Yep, the uh, Bergerons Murphy and Hot Rod are the names. From Newark, Ohio, owned and driven by retired U.S. Air Force Master Sergeant Alan Stanley. Alan, thank you so much for your service. Let's thank Alan for his service, everyone. Round of applause. Thank you. Coming up, carriage number 72 from Jennifer Broughton. It's the Kroger Company Farm. Kroger DOA is being sold by two Kroger. They wish us a Merry Christmas. Left Field Farm raises and promotes American Sugarbush articles with draft horses. And us today is Exelon. Exelon? Is that correct? That's not. That's not. Also known as Dixie. That's not Royalty Carriage Services. They're going to treat you like a king or queen. We're slate far, five steps pulling a wagon for the end of there. You can see he's nice to you. Don't go anywhere, folks. We just got another small break in the action. We do ask that you not cross the street as the horses do approach. And here's some cheering. Oh, I hear some thunder. Coming in hot! 76 is coming! You see horses and donkeys, all sizes here in our parade, but I really love all the entries, but it's great to have those. Coming up is Kurt Stryker from Stryker's Corner Store in Belgium. Sponsored by Shine Orthodontics. The Stryker family Belgian draft horse hitch. These horses weigh around one ton apiece and are between five and a half and six feet tall at the shoulder. They are raising for big riding, such as a money mill stall, and have been participating in band festivals throughout the year. A Merry Christmas from Rose Jenny. I think our grand finale, there's a large team approaching. Merry Christmas. Absolutely. Hope we can be invited right back next year, Mike. You got it. Thank you all for having us. Thank you all for coming. Enjoy the rest of the night. Please take your time. Enjoy the adventures of the county. 